Hey guys, it's May May, and I'm here with Edith today. Hey guys. We're going to be talking Made at Con, and we're going to be talking Edith's classes at Made at Con, and you're going to be super excited to find out you can still get into a few of her classes. You need to listen because there, there's very few spots left. But I want to tell you real quick, if you've never um, watched before or you don't know anything about Made at Con, what Made at Con is and the details before we get into the classes. So real quick, Made at Con is an event we put on about every year, sometimes a little longer than that, where we bring teachers together and we teach all kinds of different classes for you guys, mostly paper crafting, but there's some other stuff sprinkled in. And this year, it's in Alabama, which is mine and Edith's home state. Yay! We got Bama girls in the house. I'm excited about that. We have, a uh, matter of fact, we have Bama girls and Georgia girls, and Christopher's coming in, but Christopher might as well be a Southerner, because he yeah, is at heart. Bama boy. He might as well be. <laughs> so we're all, it's pretty much Southern folks putting this on for you, and it'll be in Clanton, Alabama, which is the, the center of the state, and there's a bunch of classes. There's a bunch of things there's a bunch of little bits of classes left, so you're not going to be able to grab everything, but there are some classes that you can take. And um, if you would like to get more information about what's going on, Shannon is going to be putting some links in for me, and she's going to be putting in the one to our website where you can purchase classes. It is maymaysmadeitcon.com, and so she'll put that link in for you guys in the chat. And look, there's a whole bunch of people in here chatting. Now, here's the deal. We're doing this in our the way we have to do it long distance. And so Miss Edith's gonna try to talk real loud. And if you're struggling and can't hear her, I'm gonna be working in the background to make that a little better. So we'll do that as best as we can. But if you can't hear her and you have a question, type it in the um, chat and then Shannon will ask me so we can make sure your answers, you get your answers, okay? So E, I'm gonna let you go. Tell us what you got going on at Maticon. All right, uh, this Medicon is going to be very exciting, like she said, because we are going to be in our home state of Alabama, and I can't wait. Maybe it's about two hours, maybe south of me, so it won't be a very long drive, but, you know, we love coming to your towns, but sometimes we just like being in Alabama. So we're going to show you some Alabama hospitality. <laughs> uh, we've got six classes, I believe, at Medicon that we'll be teaching, and each one of them is totally different. There's not any two that's going to be a lot. So I'm just going to start and I'm going to show you the projects going to be in each one. The first one is the fun and easy wallet folio and mini purse folio. Now this is the little mini folio and I called it just a mini for your purse. We'll see if you can see that. Yeah. And you just open it up. It's got it's closed with magnets. And then if you untie this little ribbon right here, let me untie it while I'm looking at it. You untie this ribbon. And then you have a little cascading thing that pulls down there that you can put photos in. May May and I love those grandbabies, so we like to keep all those photos in our purse for everybody to see. And then in that same class, you're going to be doing this little purse folio. And this is good for if you want to put the, you know, money. Uh, gift cards, whatever, to give out to people. This has got a little belly band that goes around it, just closes it up. This, this is made in with a really strong paper, so it will hold up really well. You just slide the little belly band back on, like that. So that those are the two things that we're going to be doing in that class. We're going to be doing two projects in that class. And also, everyone in this class gets a free handmade by me so if you want that okay if you don't want that that's fine too wait <laughs> but I, they, you're making a handmade gift for everybody in that class yes i've already got them made <laughs> you are an overachiever edith you're an overachiever that's awesome but um i just thought i wanted to give you a little bit extra if you take this class because these are two kind of small projects but you know, I'm going to give you a little bit extra. But you also, so, you price that class that way too. This is important that I say this. For those of you who maybe want to come and just take a couple classes and you don't need to, or don't, can't afford to invest a lot in classes, that class is only $26.95. You're going to get all the, most of the supplies you need. I'm looking at her list here. Most of the supplies you need and all the techniques you get to take home with you. So that'll be even better. So think about that one. And there are, Shannon told me, there are spots left. There's spots left in that class. So grab that one up. That class is Friday, April 3rd um, at 11 a.m. 
So that's, and it's a two hour class. So you guys will love that. The link is right. in the chat. Oh, my bad. <laughs> Shannon said to tell you she put the link in the chat and now we can. Okay. Also in this class, there's one other thing that we're going to be learning. We're going to learn how to tie bows using your fingers or a fork. Oh, that's so awesome. learn how to tie those perfect little bows because I struggle with tying bows. Sometimes mine go this way. Sometimes they go that way. But we're going to learn how to tie those perfect little bows by using your fingers or a fork. So we're going to learn that in there, too. So it's going to be some fun techniques. We're going to have fun on that one. Then um, the next one, the travel journal with reinforced gift box on the inside. That is this one. That's beautiful. And this is a large journal. It's eight and a quarter by six and a half. It's made with chipboard. So there's going to be, it's going to be really sturdy. It closes up with a magnet and then it opens up to reveal you've got a pocket on this side. Let me see if I can see and do this at the same time. You've got a pocket on this side that's got the acetate on it that you can slot some things down in. And then it's got two, it, they're watercolor pads, but you could also use them to put photos on. You wouldn't have to use them for watercolor or you could use them just to journal on because it is the smooth watercolor. And then right here, you've got a reinforced box that holds your pens, ephemera, whatever you want to put in there. And it's made out of chipboard as well. So it's really, really sturdy. That and is an awesome project. You know what you can do with that? You could use it to sketch your projects out. Mm -hmm. Like if you were going to sketch cards or sketch mini albums and use it to save all your patterns in one place. That's cool. I use this one for my journaling. I've got one made like this, and I keep my journaling pen in here. And you will get a pen with your kit, by the way. And then I, I do my journaling on this. And if I need to, if I have a picture of something that I want to keep, you know, in there with my journaling, I just put it in there. We'll also learn how to do the stitch, where we will stitch the wow. um, little albums together. So we'll learn how to do that. So And then these come... These come in and out. Look They're at just you. That is amazing. They're just in there with elastic. So you can take, when you fill this one up, you can take it out, make another one, and put it in there. So that is really good. I know everybody's going to want to take that class. So let me give you the details. That is the travel journal with reinforced gift box attached inside. And Shannon has put the link in for you guys. But if you are, if you're watching the replay, you can just go to our website, maymaysmadeit.com. Nope, Maymay's made it con.com. <laughs> and you can uh, look for a travel journal with Edith Ray. So you can sign up to get that. And there are some spots left. Yes. There is spots available in that one. So go grab it. All right. All right. The next one is one that I absolutely love. I keep this one sitting out all the time because I love, love, love flowers. And one of my flowers just fell off. My grandbabies like to play with it too. So this okay. is a little bird house card now you say well that didn't look too much like a card but you can either journal on the back or you could journal under your flaps whichever one you want to if you want to send it to somebody and you want to put them a note under there you could this also folds flat so that you can put it in an envelope now this is a larger size envelope so you may not have an envelope like this so what we're going to do is we're going to make envelopes to fit this so coordinating envelopes will be made as well. And I'm going to show you how to calculate. If you have a card that's, let's say, 5 by 10 or whatever, I'm going to show you how to calculate um, the measurements to make a card for any size envelope that you have. I know I had put a video up like that, and it was really, really popular. So I'm going to show you in class how to do that. We're just going to take some odd papers, and we're just going to play around and make some envelopes. I'm going to tell you. Give me whatever size card you want to give me, and we're going to calculate and show you exactly how to make envelopes for all those odd size cards that you might make. That is perfect. That's, That's really cute. Fun. And listen, people love box cards, and you will learn how to put together a box card in this class. That I get asked that more than anything. Please make a box card. I love box cards. That's cute. And there's spots available? Yeah. Okay, so you can grab it on that class. And if you're looking online, that one is called the Birdhouse Box Card with added bonus. And now you know what the added bonus is. She just shared it with you. Not everybody <laughs> knew till now. I just shared it. Also, I want to put in here before I forget, all of these classes will come with photos, 
written instructions and templates if they have templates. So you'll have all of that that you can take home with you and make more. You won't have to leave the class and go, man, I don't know how to do this. And then after Made it Con is over, we'll put up the videos for all these as well. So you'll have the video to go by. I know that'll be a question people ask is, will they get to see it? And we always like to do this. And I know he's like I am too. If we have a class for sale, we want those who are purchasing that class and, and traveling to attend it to get it first. And then we'll bring it to you guys afterwards. Right. Exactly. All right. The Exploding Cascading Mini Album. Now, this, this looks like a box, but it is a mini album, believe it or not. You just open it up and it explodes down. And then these little sides explode open. And you've got all of this real estate to put photos in. Look at all that. I think, as a matter of fact, I put on here, I think it's 42, it'll hold 42 photos. That's amazing. This is a gift. And you know what's so cool? This, people need to remember, MadeItCon is going to be before Mother's Day. And if you made this gift for your mom and put 42 pictures in there for her, and this sat on her desk or her vanity or her counter, she would love this. I would love it with my grandbaby's pictures, wouldn't you? That would be so cool. And then it has just a little pocket down here at the bottom that you can put a note in, slide in there. And then another little pocket up here at the top. So all of this going to be and then it just closes back up into a little box that's really neat i love that you'll get all of these things and all of your your butterflies and all that will be punched for you so you know there'll be lots of things that'll be done ahead for you so that we can get the class done in the in the i think it's hour two hours that this we have. one is um two hours and that was yeah. on thursday april 2nd okay so that one it's easier made than it looks believe me you will enjoy that one and I think we still have some left in that one, too, don't we? Yes. Shannon's answering things frantically. Her fingers haven't stopped over here. Hold on. So the exploding, exploding box. Cascading. Yeah. Yes, there's still some. There are some available, yep. Right. All right. And then we have the, let's see what's next. I was trying to go by order of how they are on the thing. We have the two cards. And one fancy fold three tier card. Okay, here's your the three tier card fancy fold, and it opens up like this. That's beautiful. Opens up like that. This will be punched for you because I don't have enough of those punches to bring for everybody. So we will punch this for you and have it in your kit. But then you will get the bling and all of the other things that you need to make this card. And I'll show you how to do those little pop-outs there. And then the other card that we'll be doing in there is the, I don't know what I call this one. I call this one the interlocking circle card. And you just open it up and it opens again like that. That's cool. I love that one. That could be a little brag book too. Mm -hmm. It could. Mm -hmm. Very easy That's a that. perfect way to do it, Coach. Let me tell you about my grandkids. Open it and let it just drop. <laughs> That. Everybody be so happy. Oh, yay. Let's get your <laughs> But those are the two cards that we're going to be making in that class. And I, if I'm not mistaken, I think this class may be sold out. I'm, I'm not sure. She's the checking. Fancy fold. Yes. That yes. One that one sold out. But now you know what you're getting in that class. That is so cute. All right. And then, last but not least. This is my favorite. Everybody's going to know it, too. <laughs> We have the purse stationary box. Look with how M cute M this is. This looks like a little purse. You open it up and excuse my magnet showing. I had to put another magnet on mine. Yours won't be showing. Yours will be on the inside. I don't even care if my magnets show. I think they look pretty. <laughs> and then people go, how did you do that? Get that magnet on there. Because you don't realize it's adhesive. You think it's like fancy, right? I know. But it opens up like that. And then each one of these little pockets opens up to reveal your envelopes on one side. And then on the other side, this is harder holding it up than it looks. And then on the other side, your cards. So that is really neat, E. Thank you. You'll have 10 cards and 10 envelopes that will come with your kit. And then all of your magnets, all of your paper, your embellishments, everything will come with the you know what that's perfect for? So I was saying the other day, I'm going to start, I have another project I want to do of um, as many as cards and we can make it as a gift. That's the perfect container to learn to make as the gift giver part. Yes. Yeah. 
that would be neat for all those cards. That is really cool. But you know, the the um, handle is real strong, so you can hold it up like that, and it looks just like a little purse. But then when they open it up, they get all those cards and envelopes. Somebody said, "What is the date for this event?" This event is April second through the fourth of twenty twenty. So coming up in. We haven't asked Siri today how many days it is. We usually ask Siri how many days till April 2nd, but we always panic when we do so. All right. And I'm not sure if this was sold out or not. I don't oh, know. I don't think it I don't think there's many spots left in that one. Oh, there's one spot left in that one. Y'all better grab it. <laughs> Somebody go grab it. We're going to have a lot of fun in this class too. And that is the classes other than the Made It Go Round that we're going to be teaching. And I'm not going to show you what we're going to do in there. That's a surprise. That's a secret. You can't see it. Um, um, who was it? Tony said. I want to see that. Miss Tony said, Edith is going to be my new best friend at Made It Con. <laughs> Great. I guarantee you. I hope you like hugs because I'm a hugger. <laughs> oh, we're Southerners. That's what we do. We were talking about that at lunch today. That's what we do in the South. So, have you got any questions about what Edith showed or any of that stuff? Ask it here. Before we move on, I want to make sure that Shannon shares with you with this with you guys, and it is Edith's channel. Um, go if you would just jump on and grab the link to her channel. Edith has a YouTube channel. It's called Scrapbooking with Me, and Edith shows you all kinds of stuff. And me is not Edith, by the way. Tell them who me is. Me is Melina. <laughs> M E is <laughs> the me is Melina, and I tried to get her to come over here to um, to be on live with me, but she had something else she had to do today. But she is going to be with with me at MadeCon. She's going to be helping me. So you have to meet her daughter. You're going to love Melina. You're going to love Edith. You're going to love Melina. Um, is Wit coming? Wit's coming. I'm oh, bracing yeah. myself for Wit. I'm bracing myself. Y'all will <laughs> love Wit. You will Everybody absolutely. Is. Grace for with <laughs> every these things more than he will ever know. <laughs> he never meets a stranger, so he really enjoys them. But this will be the first time that Melina and I have talked together in six years. Wow. So we, we used to teach together at least four times a year, but this will be the first time we've talked together in six years. So we're excited about that. We That's can't wait. Amazing. So somebody asked, um, all right, let's see. Are you guys going to teach us all of this after this? These classes will be available on Edith's channel after Made It Con. So you guys want to go ahead and subscribe now because here's what's going to happen. If you're not coming to Made It Con, you're going to forget about it. And then you're going to want these projects and you're going to forget all the information. Where's Edith's channel? Go subscribe now. The link is in the chat. It's um, It says Edith's channel and then you can just click that link and go in and subscribe. Um, and Miss Connie wants to know if you're feeling better, E. I am feeling much better, Connie. Thank you so much. You look better. Been, like, you I look like you feel good. I do. I feel good. I've had to lay off the sweets because my blood sugar got out of whack. But, you know, that's good for me. I need to lay off the sweets. So. But She's, I feel a lot better. You're I glowing today. You look good. Thank you. I feel good today. Um, let's see. Hey, hey, all you guys going to Made It Con, you can have your cake and eat it too. <laughs> Miss Joan. Miss Joan. You know it's Miss Joan. Way to go, Joan. I love that. That is great. <laughs> um, Amy Stanley said you're going to be her first teacher at Made It Con. Edith will be my first class at Made It Con. Great. Great. That's amazing. We're so excited about Made It Con. We're, we're like, it's going to be here so fast for us because, you know, we're moving in between. And so... It's Our fun. days keep, it just keeps checking off, checking off. We're getting closer and closer and closer. I can't, I can't believe it's already the middle of January. This this is just going by fast. And you know, winter's not even coming for us till next week. It isn't even coming. You know, we have winter one hour and the next hour it's springtime. You know what they say about Alabama and y'all need to know it. If you're coming to Alabama for the first time, you need to know. If you get here and don't like the weather, it's fine. By lunch, it'll be different. By dinner, it'll be different again. So. Bring, bring a sweater, an umbrella, and a tank top and you'll be good. And you'll use them all in one day. You need. She doesn't mean just bring them to Alabama. She means bring them with you because you'll need them. You will use every one of them in the same day. This morning it has rain. Now it's sun shining. And it, when I first got up, it was like, I don't know, 50 degrees. And now it's like 75 out there. So It's very nice. It feels like spring out there right now. I went up there to talk on the phone. It feels nice. Um, Shannon says it's 76 days to Made It Con. Oh, my goodness. That doesn't seem real. Oh, it seems scary. Um, Wanda said, "Man, man, Edith, you are two of my favorite crafters. I never miss your videos. I know Made It Con will be a huge success all the way from South Africa. 
Oh, I love her. We we chat all the time. I'm always asking her what's the weather over there. <laughs> I, how how crazy is it that people go? Um, it's summertime in you know in South Africa. It's summertime in Australia when it's winter here. And I'm like, yeah, but lately it's been the same here. It's so weird. It's like you never know what it's going to be. It's you never know. The Lord trying to surprise us all the time. All That's the weird. time. Sherry, uh, Serena says you do look like you feel better. I do. I feel a lot better. Thank y'all very much for all the all the prayers that you sent in. I really appreciate that. Because there for a while, I was really sick. Well, I'm glad you're doing better. I'm excited about it. Um, spring in Alabama is pretty. Uh, April's good in Alabama, too. We like that time. It's usually very pretty. All right, guys. Well, here's what, we're not going to keep you because... That's what we wanted to tell you today. And there are a few, like we said, a few classes available. You need to run and get them before they get gone. Um, we'll have a lot of cool stuff for you at the event. We're, we're getting everything wrapped up. And we're trying to get our stuff, um, all our kits and stuff done by the end of January so we can start our move. But yeah. it's so funny because I walked out a while ago and Lacey's like, freeze. I have to ask you some questions to try to get kits done. <laughs> it's funny. So I'm like, we're, we're going to get it done, aren't we? We're going to yes. get it done, right? We'll see. We'll let y'all know. We have to. <laughs> Did somebody ask a question? Do I need to answer? Um, just asking about location and where it's okay. going to be. I'm putting oh, it in it's seven in. inches of snow in Michigan. Oh, my goodness. Bonnie says Texas has three weeks of winter. That's about what we have, it feels like. Sometimes. And you have even better weather down there than we do up here. Ours is a little bit colder. No joke. Alabama, There, we basically have three climates in Alabama because my mother lives in in like Montgomery area and I'm in central and you're in north right and it'll be it'll be seven degrees warmer at my mother's house than me and it'll be that much colder at your house or more yeah sometimes when you're saying it's 70 down there it's 50 here a hundred percent and sometimes you always you if anybody's going to get ice they get it up there if they're going to get snow they get it if we get it you know we've had quite an event in Alabama but if Edith and them get it it makes more sense than us. <laughs> yeah, we get lots of ice. We don't get very much snow, but we get lots of ice. Yeah, y'all do get the ice up there. Yeah, we do. Um, Delita says, hey, ladies, I'm brand new to both your channels and have learned a lot in the last week. Thanks from South Africa. All our South Africa friends are here. It must be a good time zone in South Africa at 2.30. I think it's it's in the, isn't it in the morning. Later? What time is it there, Delita? I think it's early morning, maybe. Vera says, I can't be there for MadeItCon, Edith, but I will be watching your tutorials as I always do. Girl, I know. <laughs> I miss you. Um, Sandra Jen, it says, not finding Edith's info. Look up about... I'll put it in. Okay, we're going to put it in one more time. I was, Shannon was doing something else, but we're going to put her link in one more time for you guys so you can get there. Um, tomorrow. Uh, yep, tonight starting at 10... Okay. I was trying to see what time it was in South Africa. It is 10.24 p.m. It's, all, it's late. And it's way past my bedtime. Grand Mountain time. The funny thing is, by 10.24 tonight, I'll be asleep. I will, too. <laughs> Delita said it was 10.30 p.m. 10.30. Yeah. All right. There's E's channel. So, click on that link right above Delita's comment right there. And um, you can go and subscribe to her channel right now. And let her know, do this. Let Edith know you found her from this video. We always like to know what's working, how we're reaching folks. So let her know. So, um, Cindy wants to know if you're up Huntsville way. I am 45 minutes from Huntsville. Huntsville is north, 45 minutes from me. Cindy's I, in Huntsville. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. You know Cindy Roadman. She does, um, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah, she I'm knows Cindy. Sure. She's She's been yeah. to, was well, Cindy at Texas? Or was she in Tennessee? She was in Tennessee with us. Tennessee with us, yep. yeah. Oh, Addie, I hope you can fit in one day and made it, Con. That would be amazing. Addie yes. George says she's trying. Squeeze in one more day. Squeeze. Squeeze it in. Squeeze it in. There's still some good stuff open. There is. All right, guys. We're going. We try to keep this to thirty minutes so you guys can watch this later on the replay and not have to take half your night doing it. So we're going to let you guys go. If you have questions, 
Shannon is our event coordinator for MadeItCon, and she has all the answers for you guys, okay? And if she doesn't have them, she can call Edith and get them if you need them for Edith's questions or her classes. So if you'll just email Shannon, stick your email in there too so we can have that. She's Shannon at MayMayMadeIt.com. It's hard to bounce between those two addresses, giving it out all the time. It is. <laughs> but Shannon will um, be able to answer your questions, and don't. And you can always call our store or email us, or you can just message Edith and ask questions. She'll let you know. Um, but we want to make sure you guys get all of the answers you're looking for. And this um, Kim says, I didn't find Edith from this video, but I did find her through Meme. Awesome. That's what we want to try to do. Cross-pollinate. That's what we do. Yes. All right, guys. We're going to let you go. Thanks so much for being here today. Edith, thank you for coming in today. You're welcome. It, I enjoyed it. It won't be long before we're hugging next. I know. I can't wait. It's been almost a year. Can hey? you believe it? <laughs> February. I can't yeah, believe February. that. I know, me either. It's crazy. All right, darling. Y'all have a good um, good weekend, Edith. You guys have a good weekend, and we'll talk to you real soon. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay.